The police out here trying to arrest everybody that's in the fucking parking lot. Let me get the fuck out of here. They trying to arrest everybody that they see in this motherfucker. <laughs> this shit, this shit sad, bro. This shit is so fucking, this, this is, like, why do they fucking keep fucking with us, though? Like, that's the only thing. We ain't doing this shit for no reason. We doing this shit because we want justice, man. Like, come on, man. Man, they done ran through motherfucking Foot Locker and Walmart. Look, they done ran through that damn Foot Locker, bro. Walmart, too. What's good, Pat? Hey, they, they in Brooklyn Center tearing this shit down, bro. They in this bitch tearing this shit down, bro. I'm talking about they going through every motherfucking store in Brooklyn Center, bro. I'm right here by Walmart right now. Walmart is fucked up. Walmart so fucked up, bro. They got the police. The police came late as hell, though. Look at this shit. They over there by Rainbow and goddamn detail. Minneapolis after a black man was shot by police after officers say he fled from a traffic stop. The 20-year-old later died, now his family and others demanding answers. 12 News reporter Kayla Fish, live at the Breaking News Center this morning with the latest. Well, it's only been about four hours since protesters dispersed from the city of Brooklyn Center, according to the Minnesota Department of Public Safety. That following a night of clashes between police and hundreds of protesters. Authorities say protesters threw rocks and other objects at police and businesses had been broken into. The National Guard activated to help. A curfew now in effect. This unrest was spurred by an officer-involved shooting in the city Sunday afternoon. Police say they stopped the driver and attempted to arrest him on an outstanding warrant. Police say the driver re-entered the vehicle and drove away. According to police, an officer fired at the vehicle, striking the driver who crashed several blocks away. Mourners, including the family of 20-year-old Dante Wright, gathered at the scene of that crash demanding answers. Wright's mother said he called her just before the shooting. That he was getting pulled over by the police. And I said, well, why did you get pulled over? He said he had, they pulled him over because he had air fresheners hanging from his rear mirror. He was only 20 years old and he didn't deserve to be shot and killed like this. Like, why do they fucking keep fucking with us, though? Like, that's the only thing. We ain't doing this shit for no reason. We doing this shit because we want justice, man. Like, come on, man. Man, they done ran through motherfucking Foot Locker and Walmart. Look, they done ran through that damn Foot Locker, bro. Walmart, too. What's good, Patrick? Hey, they, they in Brooklyn Center tearing this shit down, bro. They in this bitch tearing this shit down, bro. I'm talking about they going through every motherfucking store in Brooklyn Center, bro. I'm right here by Walmart right now. Walmart is fucked up. Walmart so fucked up, bro. They got the police. The police came late as hell, though. Look at this shit. They over there by Rainbow and goddamn DTLR. Let me go ride over there and see what the fuck they doing. Hold on right quick. Let me ride over there and see what they doing. This shit crazy though. Just because they done killed another black motherfucking man. It, it, this shit crazy. Hey, look at this shit though. Uh, look, they done ran through goddamn Foot Locker, bro. Foot Locker, T Mobile. Look at this shit. They don't give a fuck, bro. Look, I'm finna ride over here and let y'all see this shit. Brooklyn Center is, man, it's like another motherfucking South Minneapolis now, bro. Brooklyn They done ran through the Boost Mobile. 
Look, candy and shit all up. Nah, I might, I might want to get some goddamn Laffy Taffy in that motherfucker. Get a whole goddamn shit. Free Laffy Taffy's. Y'all want any Laffy Taffy's? It's free. Man, it's out there. Look at this. Motherfucker still trying to come out here and see if they get left anything. Yo, yo. What's the vibes? Back with another video. Yep. So it's going down in Minnesota once again. The trial of GF is currently going on. And now the loss of life of Dante Wright. Hmm. This is crazy, man. What we're looking at here, as you can see in the videos earlier that I do not own copyright to, those are found on YouTube. I will put them in the description if you guys want to check out the full videos. The dude was saying, why they keep effing with us? We want justice. This is why we're doing this. Listen, man. Rioting, destroying your neighborhood, your neighborhood, because you got to live there. Rioting, destroying your neighborhood does not bring justice. To, to this young man It was said that He was being pulled over in a traffic stop He had a warrant out for his arrest They tried to stop him He tried to flee We know what else happened That's the story given to us on the news Whether it's true or false We do not know But one thing I do know is if you're stopped by police and this is food for, for thought and you're someone with a warrant in your best bet, police are not trying to chase you. That's why they have guns. It's very rare you're going to get into a police chase in this day and age. This is not. 1952 This is not the movie Bullet You're not going to be getting into Police chases in the street No They're going to use excessive action A lot of people Are waiting to see if there's Body cam footage Because the body cams of these Officers should have been on So We're going to see what happens man But this is a very volatile situation that adds fuel to the fire of what's currently going on. And you see, one thing I noticed is his mother is Caucasian. So his father's black. He's a mixed breed kid. That only stirs the pot more because now you got white and black in the pot. We got Asian hate crimes on the rise. What's going on, man? It's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. You wake up some mornings and you're like, what's this? That's kind of how this morning was for me. I woke up, I said, whoa, what's going on in Minnesota? Minnesota's already turned up because of the GF situation. But this right here, man, this is adding kerosene to a burning building. What do you think is going to happen? If you're new to the channel... Hit the subscribe button. If you're already subscribed, stay subscribed. I drop daily videos, daily uploads. You're now welcome to K-Will TV. I'm going to catch you all in the next one.